morning, Pirates. I'm Erica Rogers with Colors TV News. Today is Thursday, October 3rd, and here are your daily announcements. Get a jump start on your future and attend the Bellin High School College and Career Fair taking place on Wednesday, October 9th at the Crow's Nest from 6.30 to 8 p.m. Also, if you would like to attend this college fair, register to get your personal barcode at www.gotocollegefairs.com. Are you interested in math, science, or engineering? Then you should think about registering for the Black & Veatch Engineering Explorers Program for exposure to various engineering careers. The cost for this program is $40, and you can apply for this via email at explorers at bv.com. The registration deadline for this program is October 8th for this great hands-on opportunity. Are you interested in a career in healthcare? If so, the Hospital Hill Medical Explorers Post is sponsoring an exploratory program focused exclusively on health careers. These meetings are held the first Monday of each month, 6 to 7.30 p.m. at the Don Kissholm Learning Center. The cost of this program is only $20 for the whole year and students interested in attending can pre-register by emailing stephanie at hccnetwork.org. You should do this as soon as possible because space is limited. Flyers are also available in counseling. Are you an artist? If so, then you should explore the arts with the Reflections Arts Program, sponsored by Bellin High School PTSA. The theme for your entries is Believe, Dream, Inspire. With entering this contest, you can receive a plaque, be eligible to win at state and national levels, as well as gain monetary awards. The deadline for entries is November 26, 2013, and flyers and a sign-up sheet are available at the front office. Visit BHS PTSA Reflections on Facebook for more information. Also, if you are looking for a scholarship and are interested in the arts, you are eligible to enter the Young Arts program. Young Arts offer up to $10,000 award per student and works to identify and support the next generation of artists. Applicants should have strong interests or talents in acting, dancing, filmmaking, music, photography, singing, visual arts, or writing. You will have access to scholarships, career opportunities, and professional contracts. For details on this application and the organization, visit www.youngarts.org slash apply today. The deadline is October 18, 2013. In sports news, Congratulations to the Lady Pirates softball team for winning their seventh straight conference title. The Pirates finished their conference schedule strong as they beat Raytown 5-2. Attention FCCLA members, please return your fundraisers by Friday. Also keep in mind that you must pay your dues and trip fee before October 2nd to be able to go to the regional meeting that takes place October 10th. If you have any questions, please see Mrs. DeLapp in room 209. Support the cause for breast cancer and order your pink out shirts. The orders are due to Mrs. Bernhardt in room 10 before October 3rd. All proceeds will go to the American Cancer Society. Attention seniors, if you have at least a B grade average and participate in at least one school sponsored sport, then you should apply for the Wendy's High School Heisman Award. You have the chance to receive up to $500 in Wendy's gift cards. Visit www.wendysheisman.com to apply, and the deadline is October 2nd, 2013. The Blood Drive will have a meeting after school today. The Blood Drive is October 17th, and sign-ups start on Thursday at lunch. Remember that October 7th is Blue Shirt Day to support the World Day of Bullying Prevention. Wear your blue shirt and join the cause to end bullying and cyberbullying. Colleges will be visiting Belton High School scheduled from 10.35 to 11.05 a.m. on Mondays and Tuesdays. If you are interested in meeting with any of these colleges, stop by the counseling office before the day of the visit to pick up a pass to attend the college visit of your choice. Here is a list of the colleges that will be visiting Bellin High School. On October 7th, the University of Central Missouri will be coming. On October 8th, the University of Evansville, Indiana will be visiting Bellin High School. On October 14th, the University of Missouri-Columbia will be visiting Bellin High School. On October 21st, Johnson and Wales University will be coming to Bellin High School. 
On October 29th, Baker University. On November 4th, Emporia State University. On November 5th, Washburn University. On November 11th, Northwest Missouri State. On November 12th, Missouri S&T. On November 18th, Pittsburgh State. On November 25th, Truman State. And last, on November 26th, the University of Missouri, Kansas City will be coming to Bowen High School. And homecoming news, the homecoming dance is now going to be in the upper gym. Homecoming tickets go on sale Wednesday, October 2nd through Friday, October 4th. The prices are $8 for a single, $15 for a couple, or $10 per person at the door. Here's the full schedule for homecoming. Tonight, there will be a homecoming parade down Main Street at 5.30 p.m. On October 4th at 1.45 p.m., there will be a homecoming assembly at Joe Moore Stadium, and the Queen will also be crowned during halftime. Also on October 4th, at 7 p.m., there will be a homecoming football game at <laughs> Also on October 4th, at 7 p.m., there will be a homecoming football game versus William Crispin at Southwick Stadium. Finally, on October 5th, at 7.30 p.m. to 10.30 p.m., there will be a homecoming dance in the upper gym at Bowen High School. Remember to go to bhscutlist.com to view the Cutlist TV homecoming episode this week. That's all for today. I'm Erica Rogers with Cutlist TV News, and remember BHS, it's a great day to be a pirate.